Get this thing going. What the hell? Hold on. Put on the so there we go, baby. Put right it like right in the middle. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> we are sitting in the Impala. Bring a Joseph Newcomb educational seminar. Flying drones. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh snap. What up, Nepo 2017? Oh yeah! Bub! We're rolling! We're rolling, baby. Canada. We're going to Timmy's. Minus 20, going to Tim's. Timmy's! You can go to Starbucks. <laughs> These caps are like Canadian crack. Once you start, you can't stop. So what is the Google Hunter software? You think? Like basically, like what is a well-trained horse to you? So like, say there's like jazz or something that's like hot and crazy, and like super hard to handle, but can right. like go in the ring and like do it. Like, do you look at that and think like? No, I, I don't. I think that like a really, like that's, that's a great example. To me, a well-trained horse is not tense. Yeah. So, so the tension. Elimination of tension. Right. And the what do you want to call it? The like acceptance of the aids, but that's like I don't know, like trying to get your horse to be together with you, that you're able to think of an an aid or a, a something that you want to do and your horse is doing it. Yeah. Nice to meet you. You got your truck plugged in? Yes, thank okay, you very sweet. much. Okay, yeah. sweet. Sorry, those old cords you never know. Yeah. You got a mic for me? Yeah. We work with our horses where they are today. So, not that we go, oh, well, yesterday we were here, but that we find out how to work with the horse here today in this moment, you know? If we get into thinking like, well, yesterday he was here and I'm going to get those same steps as I had yesterday, like, or on the ground if I'm like, I'm going to get the same steps I got yesterday, it's a different day. And so you have to work with that horse where they are today and always adjust that. It's not a linear line, so we can't just progress on our agenda. We have to adjust to each horse and, and kind of fit them a little bit. That's better. That's better. That's, that's what I'm looking for. <laughs> oh, good. Good and walk. Better, this is better here. A little more forward. Good, back. It's difficult coordinating that, right? <laughs> so, it's definitely like those little jumps forward, getting them reacting, that's important. If you can have that feeling that they're just ready to jump forward, right? A lot of people, a lot of riders, when I like explain the feeling of the Piaf to a rider that hasn't had it before, they, they're familiar with it from when a horse gets really hot, 
right? They get super excited or they're like ready to go back to the barn and all of a sudden you feel that like they start getting their feet together and their body together and like you can describe that feeling as like the feeling right before you get bucked off. <laughs> right? Like you're like the horse is together, organized, collected, and then then you get bucked off. <laughs> but you're looking for those moments where they're like together with their body, organizing their feet, and then you can start finding those half steps. If you don't have any energy, there's no chance you're gonna get that. So you have to splice those little moments of forward in there. That's good. Rolling, nice shoes, bro. Italian leather. That's cool, man. I gotta come down for a little bit. Like, seriously. Finish the dog. Bring the computer and finish the dog. Rolling. Yeah.